How's it going, everybody? I wanted to give everybody a quick update as to where we are, we where we are at with Rikers Island training. Now, currently, as it sits right now, I am in the process of developing the CC and NP level courses. As it sits right now, the CCNA, both the ICD one and the ICD two courses, are available. So here on my site, if you were to click on the products and go down to either CCENT or CCNA, your choice to which direction you go with it. Now, because CCENT is only one track, which is routing and switching, I give you the option of how you want to move forward with that. CCNA has multiple individual tracks, so therefore I will have a routing and switching, a security, a service provider, a um, eventually a collaboration, um, stuff like that. Any track, any CCNA level exam that I hit and become certified in, I will definitely be doing content for that. Same thing with CCNP. If you go clicking, click on, it'll be a CCNP drop down uh, when you do that. Now, for those of you that are studying for either ICD1, ICD2, maybe you're studying a CCNA as a whole and you're looking at some sort of package. Rob, what can you do for me? Well, I've got you guys in mind, and that's why I started with the lower level certifications. So what I decided to do is I put together a bundle. Now, this bundle is a combination of a couple things. It's a combination of the ICD2, or I'm sorry, ICD1 and ICD2 video series in streaming format, and the ICD1 and ICD2 workbooks. Now, altogether, if you were to buy these products individually, if I go ahead and click on the products pad, <laughs> excuse me. If you were to buy this individually, you can buy the CCNA, the ICD1 video series for $45 and the ICD1 workbook for $25. So that automatically puts you at $70. Okay. Then if you were to go buy a, a, a the uh, um, the ICD2 video series is not available in download format. It's only available to, in streaming uh, format. So if you were to come in here, you'd have to spend... $40 a month to get the access or $400 a month if you do the, the yearly. And what I do is for the yearly, I just knock two months off. So you get it for a flat 10 months. So I try to give you guys a little bit of leverage there to, you know, to swing it. The workbook as well is up here too. If we were to go here to the CCNA, uh, the video series, if you were to go to the workbook, the workbook itself is, if I go click over here, the workbook is $40. So you combine all that together, you're looking at in the neighborhood of a few hundred dollars. So you figure it's going to cost you at least 120 to get the streaming access and then an additional, well, not quite, um, not quite a few hundred dollars, but it's going to take you on average three months to cover the material because I have all, all packaged up and ready to deliver. There is uh, over a hundred videos between ICD1 and ICD2 and it's around 50 hours. Just It's just under 50 hours, like 45, 46, something like that. Plus the individual workbooks. So you get two different workbooks. So it's going to cost you probably 100 and, let's see, 40 and 65, 65 and 120. It's going to cost you close to $200. So I'm giving you a break at 120 for that. And then it's instant access. You get instant access to those video courses in streaming format and you get the workbooks downloaded like that. You're, you're good to go. So 120 bucks, I think is a pretty good deal. Any of my competitors out there, they're charging you a lot more. Now, granted, I don't have rack rentals, so you would be on your own for uh, preparation and stuff like that. And I will be putting together a couple of uh, options for you guys in case you are looking for uh, home labs and stuff like that. I have a home lab. Um, if you need rack rentals, unfortunately, you you will be on your own. Another thing I want to point out to you is I have a forum set up here for Rikers Island. If you click on the RIT forum, click on it, and then you're redirected to this guy, feel free to sign up and get everything situated. And I will be more than happy to help answer questions and stuff like that. The um, Beyond that, the products that I've got going on right now, if you were to click on the course library, go to Cisco and route switch, what you're going to get is what we've got coming on. So that's the products. If you want to do the, um, right now, uh, security and service provider are, they are coming. 
it's going to take a little while for me to get them produced. So nothing on the website that I have posted besides CCNA is up and running yet. So I have to go through and I have to produce all this material. So I want to be very clear that when we go in and we take a look at these uh, options and what your uh, what services and what products will be available, if it says coming soon, it's in production. Now, I want to be very clear here when I go through and I start talking about this stuff. What I am doing to help expedite the delivery of this material is a couple of major things. For one, CCENT and CCNA, they're both available. You can go ahead and download them. Uh, or I should, you can go ahead and download the workbooks. You can go ahead and get the streaming format. CCENT is a lot, is available in download format. The CCNP and CCIE, because there is so much, so much more material on those particular exam levels, they require more time to develop. They require more time to record. So one of the things that I'm doing is I'm going through, and the uh, CCNP and CCIE will be companions of each other. What do I mean by that? The CCMP is going to cover the CCMP level material. So a lot of the stuff that we didn't cover in CCN CCNA. So if you were to go look at the CCNA blueprint, I'm going to go ahead and pull up the CCNA blueprint for you guys real quick, and you guys can see exactly what I mean by this. Give me a moment to let that pull up here, and then you'll see exactly what I mean. The CCNA, uh, as difficult of an exam as it is, it's definitely a doable certification. So we have this guy right here. I'm going to go ahead and pull this up real quick. So here on the ICND2, uh, the blueprint, um, if you come down here uh, for switching, we're going to be covering all this and then some for CCNP. And CCNP route, you'll see here inside of the OSPF side, let me go ahead and zoom in this a little bit for you guys. You'll see that it says for OSPF version 2 and version 3, and then for EIGRP v4 and v6, it says excluding authentication, filtering, manual summarization, redistribution, stub, virtual link, and LSAs. I have to cover all that additional material in CCNP. And then I'm going to be doing those videos, but when I cover the material for CCNP, it's going to be CCIE level depth. But I'm only going to include in the CCNP exams what's actual or the CCNP se video series what's actually relevant to the CCNP. The same videos that you'll see in CCNP will be the same introductory videos you'll see in CCIE. So in case you didn't do CCNP with me, maybe you're coming here for CCIE. Then if that's the case, then I will be the videos you see for CCIE for doing the basic OSPF. I'm going to be covering it from start to finish. I'm going to act like this is going from knowing absolutely nothing about routing to full-fledged, we are uh, pedal gas pedal to the floor, fifth gear, redlining the odometer or tachometer to, to the hilt routing. We're going to be digging into the meat and potatoes of how this stuff works. And I really want you guys to understand that it's going to take a lot of time to do this. So rather than record a dedicated CCMP route exam and then go back and then record a dedicated CCIE route, uh, route uh, material, I'm going to combine the two certs, the, the videos. So whatever you see in CCMP for the CCMP content will be the beginning of CCIE. Where I leave off in CCMP is where the additional content for CCIE will come into play. So that's going to be how I go about doing this, and this is to expedite it because I know there's a lot of people. I'm getting a lot of emails, a lot of uh, social media feedback. Hey, when are you going to have this stuff out? And I have to, you know, I have to accommodate you guys. You guys have been very, very loyal to me over the years, and I want to get the material out to you as quickly as I can. But at the same point in time, I not only want to get the material out to you in a timely manner. I wanted to get it to you in a, uh, to be high quality content rich material. I don't want it to just be, you know, I'm shooting from the hip and I miss material. I want it to be very concise, very specific. So that is what you get to play with here. So the CCMP and CCA are coming. I've also had a lot of uh, a lot of requests for um, the um, VMware offerings and the VMware offerings are coming. Uh, the VCA the VMware Certified Associate for Data Center Virtualization, that's in development. Um, so is the VCP for, for Data Center Virtualization, that's in development. I can develop a lot of things relatively quickly for the simple fact that I've got the, um, I've already got the technical stuff built. It's just a matter of actually walking you guys through it. So 
Uh, Cisco and VMware are both popular tracks. As as I start to go and get more material out, like for instance, my next exam that I'm going to be covering is going to be CCMP switch because there's less material to cover. It's the quickest exam to get out to you guys. And then once I do that, I might take a week and do a VMware course. And then after that one's done, jump into, jump into CCMP route. But remember, anything that I do CCMP level is going to be the the introductory or the beginning videos you see in CCIE. So that's one of the big things that I want to make sure you guys understand. So it's the same topology for routing and switching will, uh, for CCMP will be seen in CCIE. I'm using the same topology. I'm using a lot of advanced technologies. I'm, we're going to be cramming it and we're going to be digging to the, uh, we're going to be scraping the bottom of the barrel uh, very, very quickly when we get into CCIE. Again, whatever if you uh, need the back uh, the backstory information for uh, CCIE, if you're looking for that ramp up material, that's CCMP level. That's going to be the very beginning. So that's what you guys can uh, go ahead and check out. I do have a link to YouTube here in case you guys are interested. And in, uh, if you maybe were led here, I will be uh, adding in a couple of, um, uh, what do you call it? I just lost my train of thought. Sorry, guys. Um, I will be adding four to five videos from my, uh, from the CCNA video course onto YouTube just to give you guys some, some material to look at. And then if you want to see any more, you're going to have to go to the website or to the uh, Rikers Island and actually start to to subscribe to get access to the material. And so I have, uh, like I said, I have monthly access and I have uh, yearly access. If there's something else in between that uh, you want to work out with me, email me directly. I will do my best to accommodate you, but at the same point in time, it's got to be realistic. You know, I'm not going to go out there and do, you know, uh, I'm not going to, you know, hit, hit me up, email me directly, and I will see what I can do for you. Uh, I control all of this, so there's no other company that I have to go, hey, I, you know, I, I control everything. So if I can help you out, I will, just let's, we'll have to be realistic about it. So if you need it for like three months for a refresher, Email me. I might be able to do something for you. So let me know. You guys have been awesome. Thank you so much for your time and your patience. As we move forward, if there is something you would like covered and isn't being covered, hit the email, the instructor button. Hit me down here in the email. It comes right directly to me. I am able to respond to those emails. Uh, if you have not already done so on the contact page, sign up for the newsletter. Come in here, sign up. If you want to go down to the home page, the, at the very bottom here, uh, subscribe to the newsletter every month at the, very, uh, at the beginning of every month or after a very large release, whatever comes first, I will send out a monthly email to let everybody know, hey, this is what's going on. So that in case you guys are interested in knowing, I can go ahead and let you guys know where we're at with stuff. So please, 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 uh, you're not subscribing to YouTube. You're subscribing to get an update. I get an email. I, uh, I have a... Um, a database that I can pull from for the emails. I can jump them into my email, fire off the email, and then you guys are more than uh, welcome to respond to that. If there's material that you would like to have, if you would like to see, to see something, uh, a video series of something, please let me know. Because I won't know if you don't tell me. That's really what it comes down to. So you guys have been awesome. I really, really appreciate all the time and all the... Uh, uh, the effort you guys put into the, the channel, it's huge. If it wasn't for you guys, this channel would not be where it's at today. So I can't thank you guys enough. Until next time, guys, take it easy.